Hello everyone, welcome to Criminology and Penology lectures. In this video, we are going to discuss key concepts in understanding criminology. Before we study criminology, it is essential to know and understand various key concepts. So let's discuss them. First one is crime. Crime is an act or omission which is prohibited by criminal law. Here act is a positive conduct, for example, theft, robbery, etc. Omission is the failure to act. An omission constitutes a crime when law imposes a duty to act and the defendant is in breach of that duty. Example, failing to give assistance to a person in peril or failing to report a case of child abuse. The types of crime may include violent crimes, property crimes, sex crimes, white collar crimes, crime against environment like poaching, etc. Law of the state punish for the commission of crime through fines, imprisonment, or some other form of punishment. Next is mala in se. They are the acts that are considered inherently and essentially evil, that is immoral in its nature and injurious in its consequence without any regard to the fact of its being noticed or punished by the law of the state. Some acts, such as murder, are against the law in most countries as well as in all jurisdictions. Mala prohibita. Mala prohibita means a wrong prohibited. They are the acts that are considered crimes primarily because they have been declared bad by the legal courts in that jurisdiction. So it is an act which is not inherently immoral but becomes so because its commission is expressly forbidden by positive law. For example, selling and drinking of wine is not a crime in India but it is a crime in Saudi Arabia. Similarly, prostitution is a crime in India but not in most counties of Nevada. The same can be said about gambling and drug possession or use. Deviance Deviance are behaviors that are not normal. It includes many illegal acts as well as activities that are not necessarily criminal but are unusual and often violate social norms. Deviance is also referred to as deviant behavior. It is a behavior that is sharply different from a customary, traditional, or generally accepted standard. For example, using cell phones while driving or smoking in public is a deviance but not a crime. And speeding on a highway, which is a mala prohibita act, is not a deviant because many people engage in this act. Thus, while this is illegal, it is not considered deviant. Delinquent Delinquent means one who fails to do that which is required by law or by duty when such failure is minor in nature. A delinquent is often reused to refer to a juvenile who commits a minor criminal act as juvenile delinquents. Juvenile delinquency refers to a criminal acts performed by juveniles. The act may be either violent or non-violent crime like stealing wallet or mobile phones, but it should be committed by persons who are usually under the age of 18 and are still considered to be a minor. 
Most legal systems prescribe specific procedures for dealing with juveniles, such as juvenile detention centers. There is much debate about whether or not such a child should be held criminally responsible for his or her own actions. Criminology. Criminology is the scientific study of crime and the reason why people engage or don't engage in criminal behavior. Criminologists are the practitioners of criminology. They study crime and the criminal behavioral patterns by collecting and analyzing evidence. Their area of work includes the study of criminals, the causes of crime, punishment for crime, etc. Using the available resources, they come up with ways to prevent or predict crime, effective investigation procedures, repress criminal behaviors, etc. Criminal justice Criminal justice often refers to the various criminal justice agencies and institutions. They include law enforcement, judicial systems, and corrections and prison systems. They are interrelated and work together towards common goal. Criminal justice and criminology are certainly related fields, but they are not identical. Criminal justice focuses on the application of systems that address crime. Criminology involves more research while criminal justice requires more real-world application. Those are some important and relevant key concepts that we need to know for the study of criminology. Thank you for watching this video on key concepts in understanding criminology.